In this video, we will show how to wire the switch without a neutral cable, adding a switch to your network and how to set up a two-way wireless connection. Please note this setup is only required if a neutral cable is not available. First, connect the live feed to the L port. And the switch live to the L1 port. We have used clips to allow the connection for the switch live, to the adapter and to the lamp feed. As you can see, we do not have a neutral cable connected to the switch. If a neutral cable is not available within the property, the provided Wi-Fi adapter can be used. In our example wiring, you can see we have connected the adapter to the switch live feed and the lamp line neutral. This connection will then allow the Wi-Fi switch to operate correctly. Here is an image showing the wiring with a neutral cable. Here is an image showing the wiring without a neutral cable. Now that switch is powered and operating with the lamp, we can add the switch to the Smart Life app. First, you need to press and hold the button for 10 seconds or until the LED starts to flash purple. Next, the plus button is pressed. And select add device. The device will then be visible to connect. Select the switch you want to add, and it will add the selected switch to your network. Once added, this process will need to be repeated for any other switch. Now that both switches have been added to the network, we can now pair them together wirelessly within the app for two-way connection. As you can see, the switch is not working when pressed let's add them together to create a two-way setup. First you need to select the switch. Next click the settings button. Next, select the multi-control association. Now select the switch you want to pair with. Now the switches are pairing you can see both switches are operating the same lamp. And that is it you are all set up. Thank you for watching. If further help is needed, please contact us at support at retrotouch.co.uk.